All hi, friends. We are very glad to see you on our channel. Now earlier morning and we go to an expedition. To tell more precisely, we go to a two-day expedition. The purpose of our trip to reconnoiter new places, to have a rest and of course to find several interesting finds. Near us the train goes. I always like to watch trains. They always very much were pleasant to me. This time I was lucky and I can watch it throughout long time. Our places are far therefore we try not to waste time. We left the house very much early. We already almost arrived to our places. Shortly we will already begin to look for. We needed to pass several miles. It is not enough in comparison with that how many we already passed. <laughs> Remain on our channel and on Switch. It will be very interesting. We already reached to our purpose. We prepared our metal detectors and moved forward on search. Unfortunately, fields aren't plowed, therefore we should go on fields which grew with the high grass and bushes. It of course is not convenient, but there are no options. Because of this grass, we pass many fines. To the middle of the 20th century on these places people lived. There were many villages. Now on these places there are only fields. The only thing that demonstrates that here people lived is scrap metal which comes across on fields, pieces of ceramics and fines. The signal of the metal detector sounded and I found the first interesting find. It is some copper coin. It is necessary to clean it. It is a Dineshka of 1855. Two Dineshkas equal to one kopeck. On a reverse the monogram of the Emperor of the Russian Empire Nikolai I and a crown is represented. On the forward party the crown is represented too. Condition of a find excellent. Good coin. 
The next signal sounded and I dug out one more coin. I found it practically on the road near the field. Let's get it and we will clean. It seems that it is one kopeck of 1924. Coin of times of an early era of the USSR. On the back the early coat of arms of the Soviet Union and an inscription around are represented. Material, copper. I would like to find the same coin of 1925. It very rare and expensive. Throughout search many interesting metal products come across to me. This metal product has the unusual form. Its form, something reminds a swan. What this thing intended for and where it was applied. If you know, then write about it in comments under video. Just the fragment from a horse harness got to me. To this find it is already a lot of years. Such fragments happen the different sizes and forms. It is the smallest and often met element. Twenty minutes later more interesting find has got to me. It seems that I have dug out a button. It is not a usual button. It is an old button with the drawing. Let's her clean and we will look. It is an old military button of times of the Russian Empire. Such buttons were carried by soldiers of the Russian Imperial Army. On the forward party of a button the two-headed eagle is represented. Material, bronze. Just I have found the Soviet coin. 15 kopecks of 1946. Coin of times of an early era of the Soviet Union. Material alloy of copper and nickel. Early Soviet coins of 1946 it is very widespread and often met fines. Some has got to me one more find a time later. Most likely, it is a coin of times of the USSR. 15 kopecks of 1933. At this coin rather unusual design. He very much is pleasant to me. Now I will show you one more find. It is an ancient copper thimble, is more precisely what from him remained. Unfortunately, it is a find in bad condition. We have decided to take rest a little and have had dinner. We will make a lunch on a fire and we will continue search. We have very much got hungry. Wish us bon appetit and remain on the channel. Don Switch. The signal of the metal detector has sounded and some unusual find has got to me. I don't know that it can be. Perhaps it is some ancient amulet. Or maybe it that that modern? I don't know. It very much reminds a shudder from an engolpian. Several minutes later some ornament has got to me. At this ornament there is a gilding and an unclear blue stone. There can be a gemstone? Who knows? Everything can be. There now and all. The first day of an expedition comes to an end. As usual we have laid out all our finds on a shovel that you could look at them together. Also I already have managed to descend in the wood for firewood. We are going to spend night therefore firewood is very necessary to us in the wood.
At us not really there is a lot of finds because we have spent the most part of time for search and investigation of places. In the wood it is already rather dark therefore it is time to make a fire. Around darkness and silence. As it is fine to sit and look at a fire after hard day. Tomorrow we are waited by one more day of a fascinating expedition. Therefore remain with us, it will be very interesting. I hope that it was interesting to you to watch this video. Don't forget to subscribe for our channel to don't miss more interesting videos. Shortly there will be the second part of an expedition. I want to wish all good luck and excellent finds. See you soon. Я уже не помню точно.